Hi guys, Lens here. In this video, we will be reviewing this smartphone. It's a um, DG A90 Pro. And if you look at the specs, the specifications here, Android 10, we have about 6 gig of RAMs, 128 gigabytes storage. It's also a dual SIM, SIM card, also allow SD card, TF card as well. And a huge battery, which is a 4,150 mAh. The camera, we have different megapixel features here. You can see we have up to 48 megapixel. And we are going to unbox this phone. And we are going to see what's in the box. This is the phone here and everything looking lovely if you look at it it came with a case as well we're going to take this off the back of the phone have four cameras at the back along with a flashlight and also a fingerprint sensor in the back so we're going to check to see what's inside the box we have type c usb cable and also the adapter for the cable as well probably temper glass oh it's not it's actually the manual stating about the device we also have the sim tray opener here as well so that's what's inside of the box and what we're going to do we're going to power on this phone we are going to see what the interface looks like and we're just going to test a few things on this phone go through the settings and stuff like that so the first thing in which we are going to do we're going to take the same tray out using the opener there's a hole by the side you do this this will pop the tray you take the same tray out as you can see it's a dual sim and we also have sd card slot you can see that some of the features are listed here so what i'm going to do this is also an android 10 phone we are going to take this off we are going to turn the phone on for the first time lovely, lovely. So here we go we just need to go through the setup interface here so this is actually the interface of the phone and we are going to go straight to the setting area we are going to go to about phone this is a a90 pro as you know and this phone is very fast as we have six gigabytes of ram phone storage 128 gigabytes and that's something for us to be happy about so that's what's in the settings we can see that we just turned the phone on and so far we can see that six percent of the storage is already being used and this is just the phone system that is on the phone so now we are going to go to the camera the camera is right here wow this looks good we can actually change the camera setting as well if we go to settings and we can change the picture size and also the megapixel here we can select up to 48 megapixel which is pretty awesome let's try that out we can put on the anti-shake options self timer there's a lot of features here right so this is a 40 megapixel shot that i'm going to take i just took a picture here 40 megapixel and if you look at that so yeah we are looking very very nice with the camera we have the different megapixel for different occasions and you will love this phone you will enjoy using this phone guys we also have the front camera as well and this is actually looking 
fantastic so guys at the back we have four cameras here you can actually see that we have one that is 5 megapixel the other which is 16 megapixel we have the 48 megapixel camera here this one and we also have the flashlight and also we have the 5 megapixel camera on this side here so we have different cameras here doing different functions so this is what makes this an awesome phone so if you're hoping to do production you're hoping to take pictures do little videos and stuff this is a decent phone to consider in terms of the space the ram and it's one of the latest version right now which is the android 10 at the moment when you look at the back we have these four cameras which is ideal for different functions probably in a future video you will see me showing you what these functions do and how you can utilize these functions for your best interest so guys my name is Lens I hope that this unboxing review was a helpful video for you do like share and subscribe to my youtube channel as you can see the phone actually shut down very 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 fast and what we're going to do we want to do a startup test as well to see how quick it will take the phone to turn on so i'm going to hit the power button So that's about roughly 12 to 15 seconds.